BBC. Mentally touchable. I don't deserve shit because I want to hit the 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 dashboard and quitting games that I paid for, nigga. I paid for this electricity. I paid for these monitors, these systems. I can quit in any game that I want. It's my prerogative. Why are people mad at me for doing the things they like to watch me do? There are people who call me broke, yet steal my content. Trust me, nigga. These motherfuckers could not even afford. These, these motherfuckers couldn't afford a month to live in my shoes, period. They can't afford to live me, period. It costs. I'm going to say this shit again. It costs to be low to your God. <laughs> These bums wouldn't understand what that means. All right, so let's go ahead and look. Um, This shit got hella comments because because of me. It doesn't have hella comments because of the Puerto Rican dude that the story is actually about. They're trying to embrace another guy, but people are making it about me. Why? Because I am sexy. All right, let's go ahead and see what else. Hold on, hold on. I think there was one more. All right, this is the last comment I wanted to read. The rest of you guys can actually read this shit yourself. All right, so it says... This is LTG. This is LTG's wishes to be. Instead of being what he claims to be, a god of low tier. Instead, he became a god of rage quitting. With a happy face emoji with seven with seven replies. Let me tell you what I wish for. Clutch this motherfucking big BBC down your throat while I have my fucking disciples pry your mouth open while I squat with the BBC and balls. What I wish for is to never win a video game tournament because it would make me unhappy. Or not, matter of fact, it would not boost my percentage of happiness, not even at the slightest bit. I don't wish and never wish to win video game tournaments for the last fucking time. I don't know how many times I need to repeat this. My goal in the FGC was to become a personality without winning any fucking tournaments while being talked about amongst those names of people that won tournaments. And I think that I did a very good fucking job of doing just that because... I came into the FGC at 2014, it's 2022, yet I'm still being intertwined with the FGC when I drop all types of different content. I don't base my content around the FG freaking C. I think the FGC is dead. I think the term FGC is corny now. The term FGC doesn't even hold the same weight that it used to. Like I said, the golden aura of the FGC is gone. Your favorite top players disappear. Your favorite top players play other shit. Your favorite top players went to go get jobs, be family men, fell off the face of the fucking planet. Why? Because nobody wants to play a watered down party style game called Street Fighter V that's not even difficult, period. The only thing that makes it appear difficult on why you're seeing your top players that used to be godlike in a better game, right? The only reason you're seeing them lose and look human is because they opened up the playing field. They dumbed the game down, which made it where everybody can do what everybody does. Remember those evil Ryu combos in Street Fighter 4 where only Sako could pull off under a pressure of thousands of people watching him? Or Daigo pulling off those crazy, crazy one-frame links as well with evil Ryu? Or doing the crazy-ass whiff punish where he actually punished a Dawson limb with a DP, FADC, fireball under pressure with thousands of people watching? Well, let me tell you guys something. That pressure has disappeared because now we got 12-year-old kids, 5-year-old kids, 6-year-old kids getting to Ultra Diamond and Street Fighter 5. And it does not mean nothing because Capcom did an excellent job. Here's what they did. They turned fighting games where something only a few people could do and morphed it into something where even dogs can throw a dolkins. Listen, stop bringing me up with the FGC. I can't, even, I, I can't even compete at Capcom tournaments. Stop bringing me up with the FGC. Stop talking about me at FGC content. Just quit. The FGC, I would not be here without the FGC. But to me, what the FGC used to be is not here anymore. It doesn't hold the same weight. It's not fun. I don't want to watch Street Fighter Five tournaments. I'm not mapping my day around watching people do V-Trigger. I'm not mapping my day around watching people that have no business beating certain top players at Street Fighter Five. But when you dumb down the game, that's what you allow. Yo, I just wanted to talk about this type of shit. Um, he says LTG loses to himself. He's overly self-centered. Yes, I am. I got one body, one soul, one make. One set of skin, one set of bones, one set of organs. Listen, I'm going to love myself more than anybody on earth ever could. Guys, that's my thoughts on that.
Are you tired of seeing me being brought up by random fucks? You know, like idiots that use my names and thumbnails but never link shit that has to do with my channel but links troll content. You know the fuck I'm talking about. Uh, next time you're going to mention me, why don't you have the balls to ask to interview me and I could reject you. Or if I do, I'm going to chew you the fuck out on camera. Um, guys, that's what I have on this topic. I'll see you guys next time. I would say road to 100K, but we hit that road to uh, 200K. Let's get it. Thank you. Sub up, like, comment, please. All right. <laughs> um, it doesn't matter if it's me or any of these other channels that you know. Choose one person to have this interview with. I'll be willing to do so. Just name the time. I don't really care. Like I said, I don't hate you. I said this in my last video. I don't hate you. So, as long as you're respectful during the interview, and this is a hypothetical, you won't do it. You constantly said before that you won't take interviews from anybody. Unless somebody pays you, I don't know. You're weird with this. But if you are genuine with it, then sure, I'll do it. Or any of these other channels out there. doesn't matter if it's me or anybody else. If you wanted an interview, sure. Just contact me. Well, that shit was so laggy, I couldn't even... I guess. You lose. Everybody queue to the back of the lobby. I'm going to show them how to really play Urian real quick. Lagging. I can't even see anything because it's so fucking lagging. This nigga got crazy lag. Yo, get the fuck up out of my lobby, nigga. You are garbage as fuck. You got two bar mommy's Wi Fi connection, nigga. Your urine is sloppy as fuck. I can't even see when attacks are coming. I can't even see a headbutt right in front of my fucking face. Nigga, you trash. Give a fuck if you're wired or not, nigga. The fuck up on my lobby with that sloppy ass shit. This nigga, I can't even see. I couldn't even see what's going on. The nigga hit me with raw, fierce headbutts out of nowhere. Nigga, I can't even see that shit coming. That sloppy ass fucking Yuri. The fuck up out of here, nigga. You would never in life beat me IRL. I will wax you ADO in this game with no lag. You wouldn't even get a fucking round, nigga. You're a fucking garbage, YOLO, lagging ass, two bar ass fucking Did this dude really try to. Until we meet again, stay gold.